you have a duty. Today, we're going to see the silkworms. And now we're in the silkworm farm. Now let's go inside and see how the silkworms are. Silkworm or silkworm farming is the cultivation of silkworm to produce silk. The silkworms are fed with mulberry leaves. This female silkworm lays 300 to 500 eggs. The silk moth eggs hatch from larvae or caterpillars known as silkworms. The lava fed on mulberry leaves. Having grown and melted several times, the silkworm executes a silk vibe that forms a net to hold it still. It swings itself from side to side in a figure eight distribution the saliva that forms silk. The silk solidifies when it contacts the air. The silkworm spends approximately one mile for filament and completely enclosed itself in a cocoon in about two or three days. The intact cocoons are boiled, killing the silkworm pupa. The silk is often by brushing the undamaged cocoon to find the outside and of the filament. The silk filaments are then wood on wheel. One cocoon contains approximately 1,000 yards of silk filament. The silk at this stage is known as a raw silk. One thread compressed up to 48 individual silk filaments. So these are the mulberry leaves that put in the morning and they ate so much and these are the leaves that we put in now and see how much they ate. And the duration of the silkworm crop is only 30 days and then now they're in their last week. So when they're first brought to the silkworm farm, they were brought as eggs. So they grow up in the larva and then made a cocoon. So before making into a butterfly, uh, we humans are killing them and then making silk out of them. Taking out of okay. Let me test it. Wow, it's it's so soft. Oh, it's so soft and it's so cool. Wow. Wow, it's so lightweight and it's really soft. It's very plushy. Thanks for watching. Subscribe my channel for more videos. Bye!